NATO has vowed to step up attacks on Libya until Colonel Muammar Gaddafi leaves power. Defence ministers are meeting in Brussels amid a push by Britain and France to share the burden of the operation to oust the Libyan leader. Both countries are among the eight NATO members taking part in airstrikes. Earlier, Secretary-General Anas Faux Rasmussen said Gaddafi's defeat was inevitable. All ministers agreed uh, that uh, we will keep up the pressure for as long as it takes to bring this uh, crisis uh, to uh, an early uh, conclusion. Explosions have rocked the capital of Tripoli since Tuesday as NATO's operations intensify. The alliance has conducted more than 10,000 missions during the 10-week campaign, but Rasmussen said the UN should supervise the transition of power once Gaddafi has been removed.